You know, the guy who doesn't think that they're a lock was the guy that we just saw seated there, head coach Frank Martin. No coach ever does. Steady things here in this final week of the regular season. Glad you're with us, Joe and Sean, courtside here at Colonial Life Arena. I think a big night, obviously, for these seniors. They've got to channel their emotions. And he cuts it this season already. There's Gaines. And it is tapped out and then corralled by Pereira. Pereira, who he called the heart and soul, the emotional leader of this team. Kachinis, three ball to Ogbede. You see the defense all inside the three-point line, and that's where they're going to stay. And finally breaking through a much-needed road victory against a tournament team. And a team that's had such a successful season for the basket. 11 to 1, Georgia Tech run. Dijunas from the corner. Got it. But he's shooting 60% his last couple of games. Yeah, he's been lights out, especially in those two games in the Big South tournament. Corner jumper is good from beyond. No, he's, he's a load down there, and there's nobody close to him in height. How about that from outside? Kaichinis. He's got a solid. From three was one of ten tonight. And Cincinnati beat Cincinnati to make it to the Final Four. How do you, looking back now, and, and the great talent that you had on your roster too, how do you think you guys match up athletically with some of those players who had great NBA careers? Well, we were an athletic team, but more than that, we were a big, strong, physical basketball team. And I remember in the... Uh... Won't go again, Carrera the rebound. Nine for Carrera. Before we went on the air, you were on sports, and I think a lot of people probably heard what you had to say. You were asked the question, but I'd love you to expand on it, of this idea that he has to be more assertive offensively, and much of that draw from the big matchup against Oklahoma. On Thursday night, so two games in less than 48 hours for the Aggies, and on the sidelines, Alex Caruso really reminding the guys to keep up their energy, and that's something that Billy Kennedy said the reason that he has faith in this team with that turnaround is veteran guys like Alex Caruso Getting the team. Dozier to Kaichinis on a three. And that time. up against this South Carolina team. They think they can defend them well. They can get into the shot. Makers. Good stop. Kaichinis buries a three out of the quarter. Frank Martin. Mitchell missed the first one. Made him pay on the second. All because of poor transition defense. Dave, when you're coming back on defense, you should hear voices and you should see guys pointing. Finney Smith has pushed his total up to 14. Kaichinis tries to answer back. There's Lindauer from the corner. I am. Kaichinis at the other end, back to back bucket. Yeah, Mississippi State Bulldog. That ends nearly a four minute. Last four games, playing about 31.8 minutes is Phillips, but this is still a team that's getting to know their coach, but they have certainly overachieved in my book. Wins over Florida, South Carolina, LSU, and Kentucky. Carrera kicks it back. Gotcha this. Big hop step, left-handed. Go over the top of people, but he can go through you and tries to go around you. Notice trying to get a shot. Off here on this possession goes inside to Kachinis who lays it up and in. Yeah, they had missed their first five three-point attempts. They were up until that one eight for 51 over the last two plus games from behind the arc. Kachinis right through the end of the worst thing. <laughs> Dwayne notice transition three and a rebound by Mendogas Kachinis. They understand that Kachinis goes baseline and the two-hand jam. Now, poor Eugene. 
Nice look up ahead. But it's erased by Carrera. Here's Kaichinis. More pressure. They're going to put on him. South Carolina's going to get out and deny him. He can their hands as well. So we'll give it to the defenses right now. Notice on the drive. Leaves it for Hatavichis, who puts it in. Or probably... Boy, if they can get some offense out of that guy, Justin Leon, that'll be a bright spot for Florida. Kaichinis up ahead of the pack. He lays it up and in. He... Davis missed it. Thornwell, top four for the rebound. Dangerous pass, but he threads the needle. I think a high percentage of threes. You have to take care of the basketball. There's a turnover right there for a high point. And you have to be able to be even on the boards with these bigger, taller, stronger teams. Nice look inside. First assist for the freshman Dozier. Typical freshman mistake. Yeah, absolutely, but what you love about him is 6'6". Six, 6'6", six. Six, six point guard, pretty good. Can't coach that. Wow, great nice feed inside by Chinnis. Gets a win defensively. You're starting to get the game cogs with the potential of getting themselves into foul trouble. Kaichinism, a nice feed by Dozier. How's final chance? And PJ Dozier will walk it up. We showed you the slow starts on the road in league play. South Carolina, unfortunately for them, asleep at the switch to start this one. Dozier finds Kaichinis. To Moore. Out of the corner, no good. And Kevish is the rebound. Big size advantage for this Gamecock team. Notice inside. Kachinis lays it up and in. Set up on the opening tap for McBoodoo. That'll help your shooting percentages and confidence with a layup to start the game. And Casey Hill starting for the second game in a row for Florida was solid in their win against Georgia. Didn't shoot the ball well, but defensively adds another dimension to this Gator team. Kaichinis inside, he'll lay it up. Dorian Finney-Smith said, are you okay? He said, yeah. So he's back in the ball game right now. Coach emphatic with his guys. We got four or five more stops. We win this game. All five guys have to rebound. All right, we'll take a look at that as nice this one unfolds. Didn't get the stop shot. A lot of teams have gone to it. The other thing, Mike, that Billy Kennedy said today is we may go zone because of the quick turnaround to sort of avoid fatigue. Great feed from Carrera. You need to get there. Yeah, you the, home, take it. the home team's going to have a run. Oh, great pass yeah. underneath. Thank you for their shots. At Kevishes. That one won't go. Touch it in. Good hands by Silver. Notice now. Takes it, puts it on his hip, gets it up in the yard. Touch with the follow. Well, on way off the mark with that one. And now Thornwell will make it a little bit closer. They're missing a lot of mid-range jumpers. The production for Carolina has come inside off offensive rebounds. Kaichinis there. Not this time. Weak side rebound, Thornwell. Thornwell at the other end. Wild shot. Gets his own miss. And the tip in by Kaichinis. Hey, they all count. They'll take it. Quick fire from Notice. Air ball. And the foul is good. Thornwell, fade away. Nice put back down there. Going to him. Going to him, getting him the ball. He's feeling it a little bit. He had some bounce on that dunk. Now you come right back, you keep feeding him. Thornwell. Three ball puts him in. Helping him out. Underneath, nice pass. Pete, South Carolina's been in a game similar to this when you talk about fouls. That was against Memphis in this building. Silva. And he lays it up in. He has become such a confident offensive player. How about the steal? And he gave it back to him. Good pass. Count the basket. Kaichinis to the line.